Thea, also known as Eurofessa, Wide Shining, was born to Gaia, the Earth Goddess, and Uranus, the Sky God. As a titan in Greek mythology, Thea was highly regarded as the goddess of sight and vision. It was said that she played a significant role in endowing precious metals like gold and silver, and gems with their intrinsic value and brilliance. She had a brother consort named Hyperion, who was the god of the sun. Together, they had three children, Helios, the sun god, Selene, the goddess of the moon, and Eos, the goddess of dawn. Interestingly, some accounts suggest that Aethra, who is also the consort of Hyperion and mother of his children, is the same as Thea. Despite having little significance in myth other than the children she bore, Thea does appear in some texts and rare traditions. The legacy of her name and the shining beauty of gems and precious metals continue to endure as a tribute to her in modern times. Thea, the primal goddess of light, was one of the most powerful mythological figures in ancient Greek mythology. Believed to be the eldest daughter of Gaia and Uranus, she was the sister of many other powerful figures such as the Titans, the Cyclopes, and even the half-sister of Aphrodite. Despite having such powerful siblings, Thea's most significant offspring were Helios, Selene, and Eos, born with her brother-husband Hyperion. Interestingly, in later myths dating to classical antiquity, Thea is referred to as the cow-eyed Eurofessa, who gave birth to Helios. As a goddess of light, Thea was highly revered and associated with the concept of brightness and illumination. Her name was derived from the Greek word Theos, which means godly or divine. This association with light and divinity made Thea a symbol of vitality and introspection, representing the inner light that guides one's life journey. Despite her prominent place in Greek mythology, little is known about Thea's role in ancient rituals and worship. Nonetheless, her legacy lives on as a symbol of divine light and the life-giving energy of the sun and the stars. The story of Thea, the Greek goddess, is one filled with intrigue and wonder. As the mother of Helios, Selene, and Eos, she was known by many names, but perhaps most famously, the Far Shining One. This epithet emphasized her connection to the glittering glory of the sun, with which she was strongly associated. Thea was often equated with other Mother of the Sun deities such as Phoebe and Leto, as well as general mother figures such as Rhea and Sibylle. One particular aspect of Thea's legend concerned her daughter, Selene. Known for her ever-changing size and shape as she traveled the sky, Selene asked her mother for a garment that could fit her no matter what form she took. Plutarch wrote a fable-like story about this request, highlighting Thea's connection to light and her power over even the most changeable of things. But Thea was not just a motherly figure. According to lyric poets Tessicorus, she lived with her son Helios in his palace, and together they battled giants and other foes. This warrior side of Thea is also depicted on the Pergamon altar frieze, where she is shown fighting alongside her son against a massive giant. All in all, Thea was a goddess of many contradictions, motherly yet fearsome, closely associated with light yet willing to fight for it alongside her son. Her legacy endures to this day as a symbol of the complex nature of femininity and the many roles women can play in myth and legend. Do you want to explore more Greek mythology stories? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.